Welcome to Taking the Car. I am in the hybrid McLaren Artura and I am in electric mode because like all the newest supercars, McLaren have made a hybrid, just like the Ferrari 296 GTB as well. And I'm here today with this. So this is the McLaren Artura. This is McLaren's hybrid supercar with 671 horsepower coming from a hybrid battery and you see these big scoops here down the side here and i really like this at the top here we've got our chimney there which lets the hot air come out and then we can see the engine there through the grill which i like that detail and then from the back here we have our exhausts and we've got these really cool thin lights and we've got our diffuser so this is a very very cool looking car which i really like the look of Are you worried about your online data? Well, I have a solution, which means you don't have to worry at all. It's called Aura, who are the sponsor of today's video. Data brokers sell your information to scammers, spammers, and anyone else. Aura shows me which data brokers are selling my information and automatically submits opt-out requests for me, which is a fantastic feature. You may already have one or two of these tools, such as a VPN or a password manager, but Aura has it all in one and it's fantastic value. Aura is always working to keep you safe in the background so you can concentrate on other things which are more important in life. I value my privacy and I value your privacy. So go to aura.com slash tech in the car for a free two week trial. And we're in electric mode right now and it's telling me I've got 12 miles of range. In actual fact, I can get up to 17 miles of range which is pretty cool. And you can drive along in electric mode and not disturb anybody. And I love how we have this combination of technology, how people are taking the opportunity to put together advanced technology like batteries, put them into hypercars and supercars and make them just so exciting to drive. And that's really, really important. But if I want to change modes, there are these little buttons or something. Here we go, here's the engine. And now I'm driving a 670 horsepower McLaren down a country road near Goodwood with these really nice metal shifters. I'm in automatic mode right now. And I can hear that engine behind me, which sounds fantastic. I love how this car mixes the efficiency of an electric motor and the performance. There's a lot of tech in this car, just because we're in a supercar, hybrid supercar, which costs over 180,000 pounds, doesn't mean it doesn't have the tech. We have lane assist. It doesn't steer you in the lane, but it does keep you in the lane. We have cruise control. So you're not missing out on any of the tech and any of the features that you would normally get. And listen to that noise. Wow. That's amazing. That's a lot of fun. By the way, these seats are really comfortable. I wasn't a big fan of the Porsche bucket seats, but these McLaren bucket seats feel a lot better to me. So we've got all this tech. We've got cruise control. So let's drop down. We're 30 miles an hour now. Let's drop down into electric mode. And now we're in electric mode and we're in a village and we're driving through the village nice and quietly. And that's nice and relaxing to be driving through here. And I can bring my voice down and I can talk a lot quieter because I'm in an electric car now. And being in an electric car means that I don't have to shout and scream and I don't have to disturb the people having their morning coffee and breakfast in the little villages at the side of the road. Isn't that great? Once we get out of here, we can put it back into sport mode, turn on the engine and we can hear it again. So we can also change between the modes for the suspension. So this is sport mode. So immediately in sport mode, the suspension tightens up and it feels a lot tighter. And then if we go back to comfort mode, because there are tons of potholes, this is England and there's tons of potholes, it now feels a lot more relaxed and a lot more easy. In terms of visibility, we've got great visibility. I can see around me. I can see the really cool exhaust out the back. Sorry, not even the exhaust the chimney out the back there, which pushes the hot air away from the car and keeps it nice and cool. To drive it on the country roads, it's a fantastic opportunity and experience. And this is a great car to drive, it really, really is. 
I love these metal shifters so we can go up and down. So here we are inside the McLaren Artura. Now I talked about when I was driving these indicator modes. So with this mode here, which I can rest my hand on the top, I can then choose between the various settings. So you can see down here it says sport. I can then change it to track, to sport or to comfort. Very, very easy to use and I really like these. These are really clever. And then on the other side, we can do the same thing as well. Except for this time we go between electric comfort and sport obviously electric will then keep me in electric mode and you can see my range so you can see i've got 14 miles of range here this is very cool i like that very much it's very thoughtful to be able to change the modes while keeping your hands on the steering wheel that's clever and then we get these beautiful metal paddle shifters as well which feel amazing we have a very modern infotainment system here which has what you need on it and then you can press the button on the side to go between the menus and then down here we've got our buttons for drive neutral and reverse and our big red start start button something which i think is really part of the dramatic feel of the interior of a car and then it's really nice steering wheel which has been a lot of fun to drive and then let's look at the doors so to open the doors you press this now this is not going to be a revelation if you've had a mclaren or any other car before but you know an uppy door is always a lot of fun to have and then i did mention the tech here we've got our lane keeping warning here we got our lift for our front nose and our front opener here and then down here underneath the steering wheel we have our cruise control which is great to see the mclaren artura is a combination of new technology and old technology on one hand the efficiency and performance of an ev on the other hand a fire breathing v6 engine that gets so hot it needs a chimney chimneys haven't been a thing since the 1920s and yet mclaren have brought one into this car this is one supercar that brings together old and new in a devastating fashion thanks for watching